www.normalclass.co.uk Hi, I'm Susanna. I've spent most of my working life caring for animals and teaching others. In this video, I'm going to show you how to prepare a rat's enclosure. This is my rat cage. Let's look at the materials that are used. So first we've got wire metal bars all on the top section. These bars are fairly narrow to stop the rat from being able to escape. Um, and also it allows lots of air to move in and out of those bars, giving the rat good ventilation. It's particularly important with rats that have any respiratory or breathing problems. On the base, we've got a big solid plastic base so we can contain all of the bedding for the rats inside there. Inside of the cage, we've got different levels. So this gives the rats lots of enrichment and things to do. They're very intelligent rodents, so they need to be provided with lots of stimulation. We need to think about where we should locate this cage. We mustn't put it in sunlight so that rats can get hot and overheat. And we don't want to put it in drafty areas where they potentially could catch a cold. I've discussed how we select the correct cage for the rat. We've explored the rat's requirements, a large cage with a solid base and various levels for the curious and lively rat to explore. The rat enclosure has strong metal bars that allow plenty of airflow, which is vital for this rodent as it's prone to respiratory problems. When we're looking for a place to situate the cage, we will avoid direct sunlight, radiators or rooms that become overheated. We are looking for a fairly constant temperature of 19 to 23 degrees Celsius. 